So a lot of times with colorectal cancer, um, you can have things like diarrhea or constipation. That can be pretty common oftentimes with pain medications that are used or sometimes with a particular chemotherapeutic drug. Um, there's a lot of different things like probiotics that can help with um, some of the diarrhea or constipation as well as things like L-glutamine. And then sometimes even using dietary things that increase fiber or help increase water intake can help a lot in managing those symptoms. So it's really important to make sure you talk to your physician or healthcare team about your diet and also um, some of those natural therapies that may be effective in managing some of those symptoms. And oftentimes it's the balance of the chemotherapy agents that you that's used and then the um, pain medications and balancing out sort of what the bowel function looks like. Well, it's really important to ask about potential side effects and quality of life before starting a treatment plan because a lot of times those symptoms can sneak up on you. So many times you're going to be getting consecutive chemotherapy or radiation treatments and a lot of those side effects and quality of life measures can actually be anticipated. So we can utilize a lot of different things that help to manage those symptoms preventively and in some cases even eliminate them altogether. So wouldn't it be great as a patient if you're going for chemo and you can prevent peripheral neuropathy or potential mouse sores or even look at increasing your energy while you're going through treatment. It allows you to adhere to treatment better, get better outcomes and ultimately improve quality of life while you're going through treatment but also afterwards when you're wanting to return to all the activities you enjoy.